Hey guys, it's Cody back with another video. Today in this video, I'm gonna, I haven't shown you guys this before, but I have quite a collection of WWE Pop fun Funko Pop figures. Um, I'm going to show you guys the ones I have in my collection, and I'll tell you if I'm going to be getting them signed in the near future. But I think mine are pretty cool, if I do say so myself. So I'm going to show you guys each ones that I got. First one I have is Shinsuke Nakamura. I got this at Toys R Us a while back. That was the first pop I ever bought. Next one I got is Big E from the New Day. That was just his single pop. Next one I have is Mick Foley. I'll be getting Mick Foley to sign this at the Galaxy Con convention in downtown Raleigh in July. Next one I have is Nikki Bella from the Total Total Divas series. Razor Ramon, I'll be getting this one signed by Scott Hall at The Gathering. It's a pro wrestling convention being put on by T-Mart Promotions. Over in Charlotte, North Carolina, August 15th through the 18th. I will be there that Saturday, so if any of my subscribers will be there, come say hello. I'll be there all day from 9am until probably about midnight. Next one I have in my collection is Randy Orton. I've got Jake the Snake Roberts in a pop collector protector case. Um, I'll be meeting Jake Roberts also at the gathering in Charlotte, getting that signed. Next one I have is the Iron Sheik. I hope I can get this autographed one day. That would be awesome. Next one I have is Goldberg. I'll... I was going to get that signed at Boardwalk Beatdown last August, but I never got the chance. Next one, another one I'll be getting signed at the Gathering in Charlotte. Sergeant Slaughter. This next one's pretty cool, guys. It is an FYE exclusive of Chris Jericho. And it was funny, I got this at a comic book store in Cary, NC. And they said all... Funko Pops marked eleven ninety nine, other unless otherwise priced. So they weren't priced right, and they had other FYE exclusives. Like I don't know if anybody has like the Demon Finn Balor pop, but this one's an FYE exclusive, just like the Finn Balor Demon one, and it was eleven ninety nine, and it rung up that price. I wasn't gonna argue with you. Next one I have is the Million Dollar Man Ted DiBiase. I will be getting this signed at ASW in. Madison, West Virginia on August 3rd, which is my 22nd birthday, so that's going to be pretty cool. Next one I have is a Walgreens exclusive of Shawn Michaels. That's pretty cool. If he's at WrestleCon next year, I'm going to bring that and get it signed. Next one I have is the Animal Batista. Hopefully he'll be at GalaxyCon this year in Raleigh again, so I can get him to sign that. As you guys saw in my experience video, I got him to sign my WWE Encyclopedia. So there's that. Next one, another one I'm getting signed at The Gathering, Kurt Angle. So I have this in a Pop Funko protector case. So, so far I'll be getting Razor Ramon, Jake Roberts, Sergeant Slaughter, and Kurt Angle Pop Funkos. Signed there, and then I'll be getting Mick Foley signed at Raleigh Super Galaxy Con or Raleigh Super Con, whichever one you want to call it. And then I'll be getting Million Dollar Man Ted DiBiase's pop signed on August 3rd, my birthday. So, these next two single pops I have, guys, are new pickups that I got. This night, these next two I picked up today, FYE, and they were having a really good sale. I went to FYE at the Cary Town Center Mall in Cary, North Carolina. First one I got is the Nature Boy himself, Ric Flair. That's pretty cool, so if Flair ever does the signing, I'll get him to sign it. And the other one I got is his daughter, Charlotte Flair. So there's that. Now I have three multi-packs I'm going to show you guys. First one is a Toys R Us exclusive. I got this when Toys R Us was going out of business. It is a three-pack with all three members of the New Day. I paid a whopping five bucks for that big pack, and it was regularly $20 for all three of them. The next one I have is Matt and Jeff, the Hardy Boys. That's pretty cool. I got that at a toy store for $20. Now, this one's going to be really cool, guys. I'm going to give you a little background on what I got. So today, 
This is my other new pickup. I got the Sting and Lex Luger FYE 2-pack exclusive. So I got at FYE today, I got Charlotte Flair, Ric Flair, and then this. But they were having a sale, buy, buy two, get a third one for 75% off on all pops. So Charlotte and Ric Flair were each $11.99 a piece. This was marked down to a whopping $5, and you guys know, those of you who are Pop Funko collectors, this set goes for quite a bit of money on eBay. It was marked down for to $4.99. So I paid full price for the Charlotte Flair and the Ric Flair Pops, but after discounts applied, this 2-pack, which regularly would have cost me 20, almost $25, I paid a whopping... $1.25 for it after the sale, so that's a pretty decent deal, and I'll actually be getting Lex Luger to sign this in Charlotte at the Gathering, so that's pretty cool, guys, so just going back through my pops, I got Biggie, Shinsuke Nakamura, Mick Foley, Nikki Bella, Shawn Michaels, Charlotte Flair, Batista, Kurt Angle, Ric Flair, Sting and Lex Luger, The Hardy Boys, Million Dollar Man Ted DiBiase, Sergeant Slaughter, Iron Sheik, Jake the Snake Roberts, Razor Ramon, Randy Orton, Goldberg, Chris Jericho, and Kofi Kingston, Biggie, and Xavier Woods. So guys, that's my Pop Funko collection as of today, Sunday, May 26, 2019. Thanks for watching.